Okay, right. now I'm going to attempt to explain everybody here and how they're related and how it all makes sense. I'm sorry I couldn't get their sizes consistent. That's expecting too much of me. All right. I've been training her. So, <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> so this is Sora. All right. Now, he's the main protagonist of the series. We all know who the fuck he is. Now, this is his friend Kyrie. All right. She's from the same island, except not really. Isn't she from Hollow Bastion or something? She's from somewhere else. Whatever. Anyway, they're friends. Now, this is Sora's nobody. His name is Roxas. Now, unlike other guys' nobodies, he doesn't look like Sora, right? So that, you might be thinking this doesn't make sense. Well, the reason for that is we have this guy named Ventus. Now, old man Xehanort was doing experiments on him to, like, split him up or whatever, and his heart was really weak at a time, and they happened to be on Sora's island. So somehow, Sora, I guess he has this heart-sharing ability, that's what it seems to be, he was able to share his heart with Ventus. And because they shared their hearts, when he became a heartless, this nobody was created, and that's why it looks like him. Now, when he became a heartless, and before he came back to being who he was, she hugged him. Now, she's a princess of heart, so she has, like, I don't know, pure heart powers or some shit. Dumbass so, powers. <laughs> I never said that. I just said she has some powers or some shit. So when she hugged him, she was able to bring him back, but, like, his nobody would still exist, even though his heartless was gone. Now, when she hugged him, she was sharing her heart with him because he was a heartless, and because her heart left her, that created this nobody. Now, this nobody's name is Namine. Now, how does she come into all this? Well, she is responsible for this. Who is actually I know, I know I know you don't see anything there. It's just the blank it's just space. A white space. Anyway, that's Shion. Now, what she did is when he was in like the the castle where you like forget shit with like the stupid card game, um, he's forgetting everything. So she took his memories and she gave them sentience because like the organization was like blackmailing her or some crap. Um, I mean, it's, it's ethically questionable to just take something and give it sentience and then, like, get rid of it when Sora remembers stuff. Especially since, like, she became friends with him and his other friends. And it, it, it's really messed up, but that's what happens. Basically, she's sentient memories that fades away when the host gets their memories back. Now we have this guy, who is Venetus. Now, he is the darkness in this guy's heart. Like, I, th I think he's the good half and, like, he's the bad half because old man Xehanort, like, split him apart. So I'm not sure if, like, he is who he is just with this guy removed or if the two of them, you put them together, they make some new guy that we haven't even seen or been oh, exposed to yet. I don't know. But, like, he has the yellow eyes, so maybe he's part Xehanort. We don't know. Probably. Pro whatever. <laughs> anyway, so... He looks like Sora because this experiment was done after they shared a heart. So the darkness in him or whatever looks like Sora and Sora's nobody looks like him because they shared a heart at some point in time. Now, the reason she looks like Kairi is I think because she came from Sora's memory and Sora has memories of Kairi and also probably because like she is the one responsible for creating it and she's Kairi's nobody. Except, like, she maybe has feelings, which makes her different from other nobodies. And then, like, but he also kind of has feelings, too, which makes him different from other nobodies. So, so did I pass? Is this an acceptable explanation? Did I get anything wrong? Uh, no, I think you got it. I got it all right. Completely. Does that make any fucking sense? <laughs> it does. Now, now you get it. Or no, maybe you just said all that stuff, but you don't really know what you said. No, I That's... know exactly what I said. I just don't know how the fuck they think this shit up. Namora did this all by himself. We put out. <laughs>